Marvel Studios president Kevin Feige has been talking up all things Phase 2 of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. While talking about the upcoming Guardians of the Galaxy, Feige said, The Thor film and the Guardians of the Galaxy film certainly are cosmic. Guardians and Thor will take the brunt of the cosmic side of the universe, particularly Guardians, which is 95% in space. He also mentioned that Iron Man 3 and Captain America will have different tones than their previous films, with the new Iron Man being a Tom Clancy sort of political th thriller. Schnepp, do you like the direction Feige seems to be taking Marvel Phase 2 so far? Uh, I'm not so sure I'm into this whole Phase 2 thing. I think it's a really bad... Yeah, I think they should fire this Kevin, whatever his name is. <laughs> Just kidding. No, of course. It's insane. It's awesome. This is a, a comic book fan's dream. This guy is making everything all come together. Each movie is its own cool thing, a cool adventure. I'm Superman 3, Captain America, all these films that... They're just doing amazing stuff that's like kind of like what I wish they were doing when I was 10. So I'm a thousand percent into every single movie that they've made so far. I can't wait to see the new stuff. So... All in. See, phase two, phase three, phase four. What's up, phase seven, son? Let's go. <laughs> the thing about Kevin Feige is that, he, like, you got to remember, ever since Marvel kind of roped this whole thing together, Feige has done everything right. Everything yep. right he's done, from the people he's gotten involved to the direction he's wanted the story to go, the way he's tied everything together. Everything he's done is right. Because, look, I'm telling you right now, if he hasn't done, if he hadn't done everything so perfectly already, then when they announced Guardians of the Galaxy... I would have been a lot more apprehensive about the whole notion of the Guardians of the Galaxy because, you know, it's these kind of strange, weird characters that nobody's ever heard of that are really outside of the, the fold that most of the other characters are right now. I wouldn't have really bought into it. But because it's Feige and because he says this is the right idea and he's done everything perfect with Marvel so far, I completely buy in and I'm totally okay with it. Now, as far as the Iron Man 3 thing, one of the things I love about Feige is when he describes, look, we're not doing a superhero film. We're doing a Tom Clancy kind of political thriller dressed up as a superhero film. And I love that. That kind of epitomizes what he's done with this whole series of Marvel films so far in that he's doing more than just what we've come to expect from a superhero movie. He makes real films dressed in the genre of a superhero movie. And I think that's why they work so well. What do you think, Schnepp? Kevin Feige, I think he's, a, he's an awesome genius. Here's a little hint, Kevin Feige. Do this for Thor 3. Come on. <laughs> Everybody knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> Thor three, let's let's see that happen, man. Don't be a disappointment. You're a thousand batting a thousand. What's going on? Hey guys, if you like this video, make sure to stop what you're doing and subscribe to our AMC Theaters YouTube channel to keep up to date on all the movie news, editorials, and our AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter to hear about all our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.